If your Monster Hunter Wilds controller is not working, there could be several reasons behind it. Here's a list of troubleshooting steps to help resolve the issue. 1. Ensure controller is properly connected. Wired controllers. Check if the cable is securely connected to both the controller and your PC. Wireless controllers. Make sure your wireless controller is properly paired via Bluetooth or the wireless receiver. 2. Check controller compatibility, Xbox controllers. Wired and wireless via Bluetooth. Monster Hunter Wilds should natively support Xbox controllers without additional setup. PlayStation controllers. PlayStation controllers, PS4, PS5, should work with Steam but may require additional configuration for non-Steam games. Other controllers, e.g. Logitech, third-party controllers. Ensure the game supports your controller or use software like DS4 Windows for PS controllers or X input to make it compatible with the game. 3. Update controller drivers. Sometimes outdated drivers may cause issues with controllers. To update them, Xbox controllers, open device manager, expand Xbox peripherals, find your controller, right-click, and select update driver. Other controllers. For third-party controllers, check the manufacturer's website for the latest drivers or software updates. 4. Disable Steam input if using a non-Steam game. If Monster Hunter Wilds isn't a Steam game, or you're running into controller issues with non-Steam games, follow the same steps as before, but change the controller setting to disable Steam input under the game's properties. Restart the game and see if it works. If your controller appears there, it should be recognized by most games. If after trying all these solutions, the controller still isn't working, let me know, and we can dive into more advanced troubleshooting.